the main thing that I wanted to do was make something that was completely new, but that looked classic. But I also wanted the advantages of a guitar that was made in this century. My goal was to make a guitar that I could play throughout our entire set. We kind of took the best of both worlds from a Tele and kind of a, a Gibson 335 type of guitar. It's rare to find something new design-wise to do because everything's kind of already been done already. They don't paint the prototypes and I really fell in love with the unfinished version of it. Up close you can see some of the imperfections of the wood and I think that's cool because you know each guitar tells its own story. What can I say? I think the black looks really cool with the tortoise. This is the Trans Black. One of my first guitars that I, that I had growing up was a wine red Les Paul. So this has always been one of my favorite colors. I love the, uh, the patterns of the wood. This was a, a new custom color that we're calling buttermilk. And I don't know, I just, I think it's beautiful. It's important that I have a single coil and a humbucker. The sound that I probably use for most of the set. It's a real spanky, it's right in between the single coil and the humbucker, and it's, it's that sweet spot. But then we've also got the straight bridge pickup. As soon as we popped this one in, we all kind of just looked at each other and were like, okay, this is definitely it. We added a, a pretty cool extra feature, which is this volume boost. Snap that in, then all of a sudden, I have anywhere from five to 20 more dBs that I can add to the signal. Or I can kick on the boost and it's like instant overdrive. We added a coil tap so I can make the humbucker into a single coil. Sometimes I think the, the best ideas are the most simple ideas. Sterling came up with the idea of tapering the body. At the bottom, it's a certain width, but it's a little narrower up here, which on stage hugs your body just the way that I want it to. And it also reduces the overall weight of the guitar without affecting the sound. This is a, a signature guitar, but I think it does so many different things. We didn't want to limit it to, to people associating it just with like, with my playing or, or, or my music. And it works for this. It's somehow, I don't know, it just feels, it just feels like a Valentine. A guitar can be so many things. For me in my life, it's been a shield, it's been a weapon, and um, the vehicle by which I've gotten to have an incredible artistic and 